I'm BJ from RidersWholesale.com. I've got our Maris Seal tire sealant here. This is the only tire sealant out on the market that I recommend sealing your tires with. This stuff works really good. That way you ain't gonna have a flat out there on the trail or anything. The good thing about a Maris Seal is, compared to other tire sealants is, whenever you put this in your tires and wheels, it's not gonna rust your wheels. You're gonna be able to dismount your tires if you want to. It always stays in kind of a liquid form, and you can always wash it out of the inside of the tire and wheel whenever you're done. All this stuff is uh, biodegradable. The good thing about a Maricel is it keeps your tires inflated to what they should be inflated to. They'll never lose air pressure, which means your tire wear will be a whole lot better even on like passenger trucks, tractor and trailers, they're putting this in there because what they found out is, is the tires run about 30 degrees cooler than what they normally would and they last a whole lot longer. I'm going to show you now how to put this into your UTV. It's real, real simple. We've got a five gallon pail here. It sells for about $250. If you buy this right here, you're going to have enough to use on a lot of different things. We've also got a one gallon pail, one gallon pail, and definitely do it. Should be about all you need. And we also sell little bottles for you to keep around the house. This works in any type of tire that you've got. You put it in, I guarantee it's going to stay sealed. It'll seal up to a quarter inch hole. Sometimes I've had people say it would seal up to a half inch hole. So if you get something real big in your tire, this stuff here is going to keep it sealed. It's going to keep you out there on the trail riding versus coming home. I've seen a lot of days I've liked to have this in my tires because I've had to ride 20, 30 miles with a flat tire. But now I'm going to show you how to install it. It's real simple. All we're going to do is, is take the lid off of our mare seal. We've done pulled the spout out, and over here on the side, you want to take your bleeder valve cap off, set it to the side, and then we've got our pump. You can buy these optional too if you're going to be using a whole bunch of this stuff. The people that put it in the tractor trailer tires and stuff, they buy these pumps because they do a lot of it and it saves them a lot on gas. But your pump is marked in ounces, and you've got a set up here to where you can set it to where you can put a certain amount of ounces in. One whole pump is 10 ounces. These rear tires on our UTVs, and there's also a tire chart that's down below on the internet that you can read to see how many pumps of this stuff, how many ounces you need to put in each tire. But on this particular UTV here, the back tires take 25 ounces, the front tires just take 20 ounces. So all we're gonna do is, let's put our pump down in our seal. Now that I've got our pump down our sealant, we're going to take a valve stem remover and take our valve stem out. The good thing about this sealant is, is if you still have about 50 pounds of air left in the tire, after the fact, this pump will pretty much overcome that. Still recommend draining all of it out. All you have to do is, is attach your line to the end of your valve stem and pump in how many ounces you want to put in. All right, now we've pumped 20 ounces in. I'm going to set the side of my pump here to where I just put one more ounce in. measured it on my pump. After you get done putting it in, just go ahead and remove your hose. Hook it back on the side of the can here. Pull your pump back out of the bucket. Just pump any excess you got back through the bucket. Just like that. Okay, now all I'm going to do is put our valve stem back in. And I'm going to go ahead and air my tire back up. And we're going to go out and ride to where this stuff will coat around the tire. Make sure after you put it in that you go out and ride it a little bit to where it coats the tire real good. And this stuff lasts in the tire for a long time. It never goes bad. So you ain't got to worry about if you have this thing eight, ten years later. They say this stuff stays in liquid form, keeps your tire sealed. You've seen it here first. RidersWholesale.com, we get you where you want to go.
if you're looking on our website and you can't find the tire sealant, just go up to the search column, simply put in tire sealant. You'll be able to find all the different size cans of the Marisil that we offer. You've seen it here first.